I know people say realization only comes in gradually. But I don't really agree. Sometimes you just know that you are there doing something good, something that might just change your whole life. And such feelings just come in an instant. You are there and you know it. You keep living in your own cocoon and you think you're doing a great job. And then one day something happens which opens all new doors and shows you things in a different light altogether. Step for me and for some of us was that guiding light that brightened our lives in more ways than one. I am Pearl Tiwari. I joined Ambuja Cement over 16 years ago and lead CSR in the company. I am Umesh Soni, Head of Technical Services and I have been working with Ambuja Cements since 20 years now. I am very active as a person and I constantly wish to keep trying something new at work or even in my personal space. Growing old with one organization is definitely great because you feel stable, you feel like you own things and hence you can do much more. But one thing that is not that great is that it makes you stagnant. You exactly expect what's coming and that does not work for me at times. I could so predict my working day. This predictability began to grow on me and I was looking for an escape. Step was that escape for me and trust me, my working life since then has been everything but same. Ambuja has a rich legacy of over 27 years and large part of it has been built on our core values of ICANN. Uh, over the years, we have really led the entire innovation journey in cement sector in India, starting from our first plant in Ambuja Nagar with 0.7 million tons and today reaching at close to 34 million tons. Uh, it's a long journey uh, and I'm very proud that all of us together have been partners and co-creators of this great company. In 2006 was a transformation for Ambuja when it got acquired by a very worthy owner, uh, Holsim. And then in 2015, we had a new parent in Lafaj Holsim. Over the years, uh, we have realized that one thing which has really brought us where we are today is our people. In 2012, we did a lot of uh, surveys, we did a lot of internal reviews of people. And after one such review, we came to a conclusion that uh, our strength of people needs to be further honed and few areas were identified by the EXCO. One of them was how can we make our people uh, better leaders and how can they become coaches to the next lot of Ambujaites. And that's how we started a new program called STEP. This was a great experience and the incoming batch is all decked up for it. But I'm sure this is just a step that was an uh, 18-month program with 100 leaders uh, and then I think uh, the company reviewed it. We felt very happy about it. Uh, the coaching culture, the people development culture started setting in the company and then we launched step two. We saw excellent results at the end of step one and uh, we were so heartened by this uh, experience that we said that okay, now, these are the participants the, who went through the Step 1 program. They will be the coaches for the Step 2 program. So in the Step 2 program, these people worked as the coaches and a new set of 60 people joined the Step 2 program. Learning something new is great, but being able to put it in good use is a big step for sure. But what for me is a leap is being able to pass on that learning to people, sit back and see them using it. Step two, with its inherent design, has allowed us to do that. There's a lot that changes when a company transitions from more of an entrepreneurial setup to being an MNC, and the maximum impact is felt by its people. As a part of this transition, Many of us were given huge responsibilities a little too soon. 
This program has enabled us to deal with all of that effectively. All of us have been in the center of all this, growing along as the company grew. Step 2 has made us more open. We listen to each other, we delegate and work as a team. In a sense, it has made us all more independent and yet efficient leaders. There are minor things, you know, some simple techniques when they are on paper. But they bring about a big change when you embrace them and execute them wholeheartedly. We are at the threshold of the completion of the Step 2 program and uh, we are seeing noticeable changes in uh, uh, the way people in these two programs have gone through their career in the company. Many of them have taken higher responsibilities, gone through challenging assignments or taken on different higher roles. But it's not just uh, limited to how the person has progressed on his career, but what is also important how the person has been handling his team. The execution skills, the coaching skills, the feedback, the dialogue between the uh, manager or the leader and his team members is the core to all of this. I know there's still a long way to go and I'm sure whatever couldn't be done with one and two will be taken care of in step three. And that's how one learns, isn't it? Crisp values are extremely important for us and they have been given to us immediately within the first year of formation of Lafaj Hulsim. It's one of the foundations of the new company. In CRISP, C stands for customer, R for results, I for integrity, S for sustainability, and P for people. We want to uh, integrate this leadership development program along with the CRISP because who else would propagate the required culture in the organization? It is the leaders. It is the leaders who are going to practice those behaviors. It is the leaders who are going to be the role models for the entire organization and once they practice all of these behaviors, people look at them, they understand what they are doing and they follow that. And as in a relay race, I'm very happy to see that today, while you graduate out, a new batch of step three steps in and you are going to hand the baton of coaching and of people development to the step three participants, which are yet another 60. This time we are going to pick up people from M2 and above and this lot of 60 will again go through the same culture of coaching and people development. So I wish all of you all the best and may this step three, another step in the right direction of making Ambuja Simmons, making our group Lafaj Holsim, a most competitive and sustainable company in our industry. I wish you all the best.